Hi everyone, it's Jusil here, reading and reacting to One Piece. This is going to be chapter 1017, which is about to drop on Manga Plus. For once, I am a couple of minutes early. So just a quickly recap of last chapter. Uh, Tama has a microphone in the form slash person of Baohuan, who apparently can work as a, a, a megaphone for anybody who grabs her and just speaks into her face and is about to, we assume, we hope, give order to everybody who has eaten one of our dumplings to follow the straw hats. Luffy, but Luffy's not there, so the straw hats for Luffy. Uh, in the meantime, Nami has got her wonderful power up in Zeus, and uh, because Zeus is now in the baton, part of the baton of Nami, until Big Mom calls him back, basically, which she doesn't want to do. So safe to say that the Nami now has Zeus uh, and it's gonna remain with her unless, I don't know, Big Mom tries to take him back just out of spite because she was, uh, well, she was planning on having um, Hera eat Zeus, but that didn't work. So I don't know if Big Mom finds out, she's probably gonna try and snatch him back. But uh, let's let's keep it on the down low when Big Mom is around. It's all gonna be fine uh, because it was great. The power up for Nami is great. So I hope he just stays with her in the baton and that's it. And then uh, Yamato is going to keep his dad busy while Luffy comes back. So Yamato knows that he's no match for his dad because I guess... Uh, They've been sparring quite a lot uh, since he was a kid. He did say that Yamato had no, not Yamato, uh, Kaido had no mercy on, on him. He put the cuffs on and I think it was already mentioned that they had fought a lot of times because Yamato wanted to leave and of course Kaido said nah. So he knows that, uh, that Kaido's too strong, but still he's gonna buy time until Luffy gets back. We know that Luffy's gonna get back, but how long is that gonna take? How is that gonna work? Is someone gonna go and maybe give him a little look and see how how badly he's beaten or he's just gonna take a nap and then be fine i wonder uh don't remember exactly what else we had well i guess uh, we know that the uh, the cp0 group doesn't um doesn't exactly know well just because it didn't happen i guess they don't know that we have more allies because tama didn't give the order to all these um these um i guess smile fruit uh users to be on our side, so technically their information was still correct, but now it's gonna get flipped on, on, when when we get the allies. So let's see if that happens. And of course, in the meantime, we're looming over uh, the, um, the Wano mainland and slowly going towards the flower capital, where everybody was just having fun at the fire festival and uh, not seeing the massive demon island just uh, flying by, by the moon and then getting closer and closer. Let's see, it's five o'clock, so let me refresh, because yes. Okay, da, da, da. one quick thing, sorry for not putting out any other videos, <laughs> it's just not happening at the moment, but the One Piece is my, my one constant that always brightens up the mood, so I hope you enjoy these, and then eventually I'm gonna put out new videos again, but for now it's only One Piece. Okay, it's out, yes, uh, and there's Buggy in the cover, right? Yes, the order, aha, Tama's order, yes. Read the request that uh, chimpanzees solving puzzles with Buggy's body. Why? <laughs> By Kamizonaru. Okay, why? <laughs> you know what? I don't. It's fine. It's uh, it's cute. <laughs> That's okay. Let's go to the chapter. Performance floor inside the dome. What is that kid doing in the middle of a battlefield? All right, because you care about that kid, but not about Momonosuke, who is the same age. Like, I'm sure there's there's other kids around there and you don't give a shit, so why suddenly this kid is a problem? Let's read. Uh, okay, Tama, looking onto the, the mess with Queen and uh, Sanji noticed that Tama was there as well, last chapter, and everybody there. What happened, Bao Huan? What the oh, oh, because Bao Huan is inside um, Usopp's plant. Who are you, little girl? <laughs> no, Tama, no, 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 no! She fainted! No, come on! No, she fainted before she could give the order, uh, because because Queen scared her, oh shit, <laughs> and she just blop. But Nami and Uzup are there, so it's gonna be fine, it's gonna be okay. And um, uh, Ulti is out for the count at the moment because of Nami's attack, so come on, l l l let them wake Tama up and let's do this shit, let's see. Fourth floor, Kyaha, a cat lady with, with a gun, and Jimbe being a bit battered, not a word of complaint, Jimbe. This started as a battle of 5,000 against 30,000. We were always going to be outnumbered. I never expected you to fight me one-on-one -on -one from the start. Ha ha ha, very perceptive of you. You've been a real pain. Oh, okay. Oh, because um, who's who is not playing fair. 
what else is new like these guys of course nobody would expect them to be um yeah to fight with honor so he's got his uh, cat underlings and other people who i don't know if they're all meant to be like cat like because maybe the one in the middle could look like a lion and the one on the side's got cat ears but i'm not sure if they're all like all of them cats are just random underlings that are also fighting Jimbe with who's who. That's right. Your job is to keep your officer... Our job is to keep you officers occupied. Yeah, fair. Here comes more of them. Oh, that's Frankie. All these grunts keep swarming out of the woodwork. Okay, yeah, just random people coming in and not letting them have a one-on-one fight. That's, yeah, expected. Annoying, but expected. This is what it means to fight a battle of numbers. Don't blame me for it. It's Jack and... People looking terrible just right below. And, uh, okay, uh, dog storm. Apparently the pleasure and the waiters on the performance floor switch side on us. What a bunch of jokers. What should we do with them? Beat them down and kick them out. Punish them all. Eliminate every last traitor on the floor. Yeah, it's the gifters. To be honest, how do you recognize who is a traitor? Like, if they have a tiny bit of a brain, they're just going to pretend and they're fighting with you and then stab you in the back because it's not like, I don't know, you can recognize. They're all... Devil fruit, um, smile fruit eaters, anyway. But what do I know? What do I know? Are these people this smart? Maybe not. Is it even smart? <laughs> Maybe I'm not. But okay, let's see. Yeah, the gifters. And they're just fighting each other now, of course. You can do it. Be strong, Otama. She's up. She's up. All, all my friends who ate the millet dumplings. And suddenly there is attention. She's yelling again, huh? Please listen up. What's with that brat? Knock her off that balcony. You gotta change sides and fight for Big Bro Luffy and Momonosuke. (laughs) There it is. Is it gonna work? Is it gonna work? Oh, Luffy. Oh, Luffy's just... (laughs) He's with the the heart pirates. (laughs) And he was really just drowning and they're... Okay. (laughs) He's spitting out the water now. Hang in there, straw hat. Don't die on us. (sighs) Wow, we were so high up. Oh, they're fine. Kidemon Kiku. Right, Momo, my goodness. Where are they now? Uh, Shinobu and then Momo. We were so high up, so they're they're um on the ground, like not on Onigashima anymore? No. How, what, how would they have? Maybe? I don't know. We don't see where they are. Because they could be like at the bottom of the, the, the Onigashima island, or they could have fallen on, on Wano, but I doubt. I doubt it. I think they're still somewhere on, on Onigashima, just away from everybody else, because they fell from from the top. I'm not 100% sure there. Sorry if it's obvious, it's just not to me at the moment, but okay, so uh, Momo is with Shinobu and they're fine, of course. Kinemon Kiku! Let's not think about them, please. Oh my goodness, I hope they're gonna be fine eventually. You gotta help us beat Kaido! And this is still Tama giving the order. There we go, she's giving the order! Um, Briscola? What's the matter? <laughs> Someone pounded little kid flat, whatever she's talking about. Briscola, what are you doing? <laughs> He's, oh, 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 your wish is my command, master. And Briscola starts swinging around. <laughs> I know that, um, I'm pretty sure everybody who's reading this in English is going to call him Briscola. But just so you know, Briscola is the correct name because it's an Italian card game. So I'm going to use the Italian pronunciation. <laughs> But okay, Briscoe off he goes, just smacking people left and right because he's listening to Thomas' order. The gifters are acting strange. Yeah, I got you, Master. Whoa, why are you obeying that little kid? Just have a dumpling, have a dumpling. Don't, don't, don't worry about that. <laughs> Take down Kaido, join in, boys. What do you mean, Daifugo? Hey, what's going on? What does this mean? Are they in fighting? So our guys were not informed about this, the fact that Thomas got the millet dumplings and this was, I guess, there was no time. So they just went for it and this is working. I hear loud and clear, master, even the giraffe. Hamlet's gone mad! Yeah, Hamlet, sure, the giraffe guy. That's just uh, (laughs) the best. Jinbei, first son of the sea, I'll handle the peanut gallery for you. What is this? Is this a snake? What is with the chin? Oh my god, (laughs) look at the chin, it's so stupid. Just focus on crushing who's who. Fourth floor speaking. Poker, the headliner, has suddenly turned traitor. What are you doing, Poker? We didn't. We hadn't met Poker, right? I don't... What does that even... What is that design? It looks like he's got snake... snake legs. And he's got, like, Kaido's horns and the... the... 
I don't even know the hair or the mane, whatever, but <laughs> that's snake legs. <laughs> I don't know whatever that is, but that's poker. We're gonna help you out, Samurai. Second floor speaking. We're behind Straw Hat all the way. The gifters are turning on us. What? And sure enough, there's people turning left and right. That's great. And there's a little mouse that is so cute. So cute. So small. Look at that. The tiny mouse with the with the eye on his face. Bless. And <laughs> the CP0 guy is like, the fuck? Very strange. What is happening? Gifters are rampaging on the third floor. Right brain tower speaking. The gifters are out of control. Basement first floor speaking. What's going on, man? All of Gunigashi is in chaos. <laughs> Queen is just like being <laughs> very massively looking like the, the, these people. What? And yeah, sure enough, they're just beating each other up. Left brain tower pleasure hole by the pawn speaking. You did it, Otama. <laughs> Nami just hugging. Tama, ha, phew. The plan was a smashing success. I wonder the same thing that I was thinking. I can't remember if I said it last week or the week before. If Tama gets knocked out, does that work like with sugar? That everybody just turns coat again or or is that longer lasting for whatever reason i mean it makes sense to me they would work like like sugar's power but maybe not i guess if it does happen we'll find out but uh, for now we've got them on our side as planned did that little kid do this sanji sanji you're right there sanji come on oh, oh look at there he goes all right the uh, queen was charging up a beam uh, trying to um attack of course satama and uh, and uh, nami and uzo but uh, Nami and Uzo uh, run away for a second and then you see Collier strike coming in and Sanji kicking the shit out of Queen's face. <laughs> nice. Damn it, Judge son again. Could we go, like, could we introduce ourselves so you stop calling somebody somebody's son? Or whatever. Don't ever say that name to me. Exactly. Are you part of his insane research team or something? You mean Mads? That was ages ago. Mads? Just look at my body. I'll come straight with you. I'm a cyborg. <laughs> no, really. I mean, we hadn't noticed with the neck and all that shit, but... Oh, wow. Or or all of this, whatever this is. Because that's supposed to be a secret, Sanji says, rightfully, because what the hell? <laughs> that's got, like... Oh, the tail became like a... Like a Doc Ock thing, like a Doc Ock arm. The, the hair as well? Like, everything? Everything? It's, it's a, is it like Frankie? Like, Frankie keeps coming out with things that we didn't really know he had, but I guess maybe just because we know that he has them now, it's no longer so surprising, but with Queen, it didn't really look like it. So, I don't know, the hair, the hair even, he's got one of those at, at the bottom of the, the end of his hair, and the arm is bionic, and the, uh, the other arm looks normal for now, but I guess it can open too, because sure, why not? So, okay, Mads though, Mads, we hadn't heard his name before. I guess it's another thing that's connected to maybe Vegapunk. Sure, let's just keep throwing out these names and the, of, of secret stuff, okay, that maybe we're gonna get answers about later on. Oh, look out, it's Queen's man-beast form, keep your distance. So you figured it out, huh? Not that it'll help you win. Can you manage things over there, Chopper? <laughs> okay, Zoro, sure. <laughs> I, I'll be fine. You just focus on yourself, Sonny. Who's talking? Is that... <gasps> Wait, Chopper. Oh, is that Chopper in... in... <gasps> What's her name? I can't, I can't remember her name. Uh, is it true? Miyagi? Miyagi is the goat, isn't it? Oh, okay, but I can't help but worry. Because, because he's super weak. Because he... Cause he... He turned back from the monster form. So he, he looks tiny. Is, it, is he smaller than, than before? I don't know. He's in Tr Tristan? Is that... Oh, I, I can't remember. Sorry. The, the name of the, the nurse, Mink. But the... So, okay. I, I, I'll be fine. You just focus on yourself, Sunny. <laughs> Sunny? Uh, okay, but I can't help but worry. <laughs> I guess because of the voice. So is it true, Miyagi? Did you have this medicine on Zo the whole darn time? He is too small. Oh, oh, no, no, tiny, tiny chopper, I'm dead, he's, he's this big, micro chopper, micro chopper, no, it's too cute, I'm gonna die, but baby geezer, chopper, rumble ball side effects, I don't know enough about it to give it to him, does it really have ultra regenerative effects, 
Yes, but only temporarily, and in return, you suffer twice as much later. I mean, imagine Zoro not accepting something like that. It's gonna help me now, give it to me, I'm just gonna suck up the pain later on. What? <laughs> None of them is thinking about the the future enough to not have to, to need it right now, so of course he's gonna take it. There's no time for debate, just give it to me. Zoro, off he goes. I don't care what happens to me later. Ah, uh, you heard that. The only thing that matters is being able to fight now. I, I, I mean, no doubt that he was gonna see this. He's still wrapped up in the cross thing. But Micro... Chopper, oh my goodness, that is precious. I don't... So, the hat... The, the, the samurai hat is so big on him because he's, he's so tiny. Oh my goodness, that is adorable. So that's the side effect. But I guess... I mean, I, I, I hope, I have to think it's temporary, so he can't fight for a while because he's like a mini thing, but the, he's so cute, I'm gonna die. Okay, let's move on from baby geezer chopper, bless. Uh, fourth floor, okay, so he, uh, they've got a medicine for um for Zoro, which is amazing. It's just gonna have massive, another massive power up for a bit and then just collapse. Okay, that's, that's, uh, that's fine. I'm sure the collapsing is gonna be okay. Fourth floor. Uh, yeah, gifters. Why? I don't know what's happening, but it's clear I have to actually try fighting now. And he's got. Oh, who's that? Wait, is that a, a knife that came out of a a katana sheath, or was that short? Because I don't I don't know why would that be. Did he have? Let me see. Yeah, it looks like it. So he he has a normal. It looked like a normal katana, but then he takes it out and it looks small. Unless it's just the, the perspective, like... <laughs> unless I'm just silly, because it looks like a mini knife, or maybe it's just the, the, the way it's drawn. Anyway, let's find out. I don't know what's happening, but it's clear I have to actually try fighting now. That's um, who's who versus Jinbei. Blade pistol? Blade pistol? That's mm, interesting. So he switches the blade and it looks like... It's shooting stuff from the blade. That's cool. Sure. Okay. But uh, Jinbei goes fishman karate. Okay. Oh, but nah. <laughs> Jinbei. Jinbei. Jinbei looking badass. Amazing. Arabesque breakfast. Shave. Okay. Oh, shave is, uh, is him um, disappearing. Who's who disappearing away from, from Jinbei's attack. Nice. But the, is it the same? Is it something? Sanji used or someone else that used the same kind of uh, very swift move for jumping away or flying away. Can't remember if it was Sanji though, someone else probably. Okay, so he jumps on top of Jinbei, coming in with a tempest kick, but Jinbei blocks. Okay, and uh, they ooh, oh okay, cut off a pillar, a very pretty pillar though. I do I do love the aesthetic of the whole of Onigashima, so it, I'm sad that they're gonna wreck the whole place, but uh, it's necessary. It's what needs to be done. So when once Wano is liberated, I can focus on all the pretty sh scenery, but not now. Uh, so should I call this Iron Body then? Those are the six powers, the fighting abilities of government agents. Right. What? Yeah, yeah, okay. That's, w that's what it was. It wasn't Sanji. It was, oh my god. <sighs> Names. I'm probably gonna say something wrong right now, but the guy is back in in Eni's lobby. They had these, like, um, Blueno and those, that lot. Were they the ones that had these moves, like shave and stuff like that? Sorry if I'm misremembering <laughs> stuff. It's just that it was familiar, but I couldn't pinpoint who was using it. So, okay. Uh, and Jimbe is recognizing these moves. Should I call this Iron Body then? Those are the six powers, the fighting abilities of government agents, which reminds me, and who's who is shifting into the, the, the tiger form. I heard about a member of the secret government agency CP9 who escaped from jail. Seems strange that a secret agent would be in prison, however. Haha, <laughs> I can't believe you remember that. Uh, yeah, that was me. I knew you, but you don't know me. Okay, so he used to be CP9 with with um, Luchi and all of those. Okay, the Kaku, Luchi, Blueno, can't remember, Khalifa, all of them. Okay, I happen to like what I am now, but I went through hell all because of a single little mistake 12 years ago. You know they used to say I had just as much potential as the genius Rob Luchi. 
Oké, okay, oké. Okay. Fang pist. What? What the <laughs> wow, that is so cool though. He's got some incredibly cool moves. Uh, so, so he attacks with the, um, I guess, the, the shockwave of his moves. He doesn't actively touch you like with the, with the sword. It's the shockwave of it that sends bullets. And this is Fang Pistol and it looks like, like a shark's um, teeth just coming at you, okay? But Jimbe just... Jimbe, the coolest. Jimbe just goes... <laughs> and dodges. Jimbe, Jimbe, please, okay? We're, we're, we're all not worth it, okay? Single little mistake 12 years ago. Another thing that eventually <laughs> we're gonna find out about, I hope. Wow, okay. I, I, don't, I don't remember if this is something that we were... Um, told before like something about one rogue cp9 agent or whatever that was missing i don't i don't remember i just want to keep reading now but that's interesting it's so many little things that link back to people we already knew okay okay cool and the the, the poor pillar behind is just being chomped away yes i've never seen those six powers before i pity you but i have nothing to do with your fate that's why you're wrong remember what you said Hellsmen of a straw hat crew very proudly the mention of that name brings back the bitter past. Twelve years ago, a devil fruit was stolen from a government ship. And when Straw Hat Luffy appeared two years ago, I was shocked to learn the truth. That Straw Hat had eaten the very Gangnam fruit that was stolen from that ship? What? Wait, what? Wait, 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 no, no. That doesn't make any sense. No, it does. No, it does. 12 years uh, Luffy was... Uh, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, what? The... G oh, wait. <laughs> so Shanks stole... Uh, I mean, the Shanks pirates, the red-haired pirates, red pirates stole that. We, we knew, right, that they had stolen it way back when, uh, when, when they... When they we're talking about it with, with with Luffy forcefully because because he ate it. They did say, "Oh, we stole treasure and this." And then, I don't remember. That was like what chapter one or two. I don't remember exactly what they said. I'm I'm gonna go and look at it though, because I was like, "Oh, okay." So that's where you're wrong. Well, what you said, okay? The mention of that name. And when Straw Hat Luffy appeared two years ago. I was shocked to learn the truth. It's true. He didn't really... It wasn't really two years ago that Luffy appeared. I mean, I guess you heard about him just two years before, but it was a bit longer because there's a two-year time skip, but then there was time before, and there's been time now. I know it's probably just months, even though we've been here for more than 20 years. For them, it's only been a little over two. Oh my God. But, uh, okay. That's just... Oh, that's just so interesting, though. I want to go back and see if we know exactly why he would be so mad about this specifically like because did he, 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 he used to be because because oh because maybe he was in charge of that so because if i went through hell all because of a single little mistake 12 years ago because he was cp9 and maybe he was on the ship the government ship that that had the devil fruit or I don't know, something connected to that though. And so he's got a, <laughs> he's holding a grudge because because Luffy has the fruit that was so I mean, Luffy didn't steal the fruit. Shanks did, and then Luffy just snatched it from him by mistake. <laughs> so hey, but okay, this is cool though. Oh, I want to see other people's reactions because I want to understand what I missed. I must have missed some connection here, but it's so cool. It's interesting. I, I love it when stuff comes comes full circle and then we learn about things that we barely had heard about so many chapters ago. Okay, so this was lovely. And now we have so many gifters on our side. So many, um, not just gifters, I don't think. Anyway, so many, so many of the um, Animal Kingdom pirates on our side. It's great. Let's, uh, let's have a count, maybe. CB0 people, let me know about the numbers. And Luffy is being, <laughs> I guess, resuscitated by the heart pirates. He's going to be fine eventually because... I don't know what Kaido did though, because it wasn't just that he was drowning, like he had been clobbered by Kaido and he was already fainted when he fell, so it's not just the fact that he was drowning in the sea, but I'm sure it's gonna be okay.
Right, this was fun. <laughs> it was great fun. Hope you enjoyed the read through. I'm gonna go and watch other people's reviews and reactions to see again what I missed. And with one piece, I will see you. Mm -mm. Is it next week or is there a break? It is next week. Okay, bye.